Hi, hello everyone. In this video, we will see the file system and also we will see the Linux file system structure. So first, we will see the basic definition of what is file system. So it is a system used by an operating system to manage files. The system controls how data is saved or retrieved. So now we will see the image. This is our showcase. So now we will see the shades, accessories, skirts and jacket, shoes, pants. So, it all means different things. Okay. So, over a particular things, you know, we will arrange the rack in a particular thing. Because, if we go to the shirt, we will go to the shirt section. We will go to the shirt section. Okay. And, so, we will store the data in this particular section. We will store the data in this particular section. And, we will go to the correct section. Okay. So, that is the purpose of this file system. So, next, we will go to the second image. So, introduction to file system. Operating system stores files and directories in an organized and structured way. So, if you look at the system configuration file, we will save the folder A and the user files in folder B and log files in folder C and comments or scripts in folder D and so on. Okay. So, if we save the file in a particular folder, we will save the file in a particular folder. So, next, we will see the file system. File system structure, okay. This is the file structure in Linux, okay. So, all of you basic, where you start with the root. So, root is indicated by the root of the root, forward symbol. And in the root directory, the remaining all directories are saved, okay. So, you can check it. And next thing, what do you think? This is the overfile structure and definition that I mentioned. So, if you think about slash temp directory for temporary files and slash home directory for user, okay? So, slash warna system logs. So, in the way, over directory is over particular user, okay? If you have any doubt, you can check it, okay? So, next, we are going to see commands used to navigate file system. So, there are three types of navigating systems. So, first thing I am going to see CD and CD stands for changing directory. It is a primary command for moving you around the file system. Okay. CD, what I am going to say is change directory. So, in one directory, we are going to move to the other directory. CD and one directory naming is going to move to the other directory. Okay. And next thing I am going to say is PWD. And it stands for print working directory. Okay. It tells you where you are clerking and what is your location. I have told you to run this command. And next thing I am going to say is LS. So LS stands for list. And it lists all files and directories in your current working directory. So in your directory, there are files or directories. That is the display. And files are the display. White color ला कामी को and directory से लमे blue color ला indicate आऊँ okay so अदर नलन difference उन्हें easy आप पुरुष को मिलियो okay next using of tab की to auto complete so वो पार अगर data आप दिन सोली उर file रुके okay and इपन आ da आप दिन सोली टी tab करते ना तो auto fill आये दो I mean अंदर words वंदे unique आ रखनो suppose इन और file और directory वंदे da आप दिन सोली start आगे okay इपन आ again da आप दिन सोली tab करते ना and the DL start agra file shall have a list of them and next to unique and over letter porting now and the letter of where in the file to start agra now will call the way out of complete item okay now that is the use of this tab key so upcoming videos on IP real time up until the principal comic now okay so next thing and so we party now the next sort of file format okay so this is the Linux file or directory properties so in LS put the word commanding run under a bar will kill a file to list of audience on it well so in the format let on a load a list of files on the other list one I mean in the full format level now number LS hyphen L have been so in the option in a good data will full format look at the go in LS have been so we were all command button in run panning now just to look at file name what now will be spare on file file name or directory name okay and if you think not the audience will start and learn directory and yellow start after the lami I'm loaded link files and in the hyphen now it's a normal file okay now so either put in an extra long look on it ram and this is for links and this is for owner group size month in which month you have created the file and the date time name of your file or directory okay so either put in upcoming videos less older just you don't outline what to tell you going to be in a lot of Linux files zero coding so me okay so the part in a Linux sort of file types okay so the part in a simple and a bomb to the starting the hyphen to the regular file and D in the directory and yell for link 
So, we have a brief video in the outline. So, we will see what is the file system in this video. And we will see the file structure in the Linux file structure. And we will see the file structure in the file structure. And we will see using commands how to navigate your file system. And we will see the format in Linux file structure. And also, we will see the Linux file types. So, we will see the next video. Thank you for listening. Have a nice day.